I am a professional Asian that specializing in failure management. Today, we look at some psychological punishment. Very effective if your child has emotion. First, we have the talk back trap. You say something stupid to bait the reply. Getting 99% in math is how you become homeless. Then, we wait for your son to say literally anything. 99% was the highest in the class. Bam, got him. What the hell you say? Huh, you talking back to me, huh? Wait, wait, I wasn't talking. That's why playing PlayStation makes you unemployed. Okay, I'll go study. What the hell you talking back to me, huh? No, no, I was only agree with. That's what happens when you hang out with failures. <laughs> the next psychological punishment is called turn everything into a lesson. Literally, everything. Dad, I'm going to school. I remember going to school. Ah, uh, I remember putting on my shoes once. Ah, uh, I remember drinking water once. Ah, uh, I remember sleeping once. Ah, uh, I remember pooping once. Very important lesson, listen. Bonus, it's even more effective if the lesson let make no sense. I remember that your uncle skipped school once. Now he's fat. How does that finally let? We have our fan favorite. The wooden spoon. We start off with a special bonus. You can even use it to cook soup. I didn't know till I was 35. See, the wooden spoon is very deceptive, okay? It's small and light, but when you have mass, you can swing at one end. It's effectively a hammer. Oh my god, it actually worked. <laughs> when your son get 99% in math, hold out the hand, he won't be able to use that hand for 7 to 8 hours. See, children use their hands every couple of minutes, hundreds of times throughout the day. So every time, they reminded of the failure, reinforcing it, the disappointment. Very effective. As parents, we need to share our wisdom with our children. This lesson is called, repeat the same thing louder. Dad, I, I don't know how to do this question. Okay, let me see, what's going on? X equal integral of E squared. Okay, what's integral of E squared? Uh, I don't, I don't know. No, 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 no. What's integral of E squared? I, 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 don't, I don't know. What's the integral? I don't know. What's the integral? I, I don't know. What's the integral? I don't know, what is the integral? No, you answer me. The louder you repeat, the more knowledge you're passing down to your children. What's the integral? What's an integral? What's the integral? What's the integral? Jesus, oh, help your boy out. What's the integral? You dumb mother... You continue doing this till your children are about to pass out. <coughs> For maximum effect, turn the whole thing around and make it look like he's overreacting. Okay, breathe, breathe, breathe. Listen, what the hell you so dramatic? What's the big deal? Just a math question. You don't know, you ask teacher tomorrow, no problem. Huh? Stop crying, you get constipated. Next, we have an ancient art. This one hits close to home. I remember when I was 10, my mother would randomly 360 no scope me across the kitchen. This is the ancient art of throwing. Literally anything. Die. <laughs> I didn't know you were coordinated. You could play baseball, you know. <laughs> you gonna die. Uh, oh, your table! It's broken! Are you always this annoying? <laughs> okay, you are. Look, I'm not trying to like knock your hustle or anything like that. I'm just saying you're way overrated. Whoa, overrated? We're not even comparable. You're like an auction. Okay, but there's things that you can like buy outright. I don't even think this generation remember you. I mean, like, I'm really not that old. eBay sounds like an adapter. Look, man, I'm not going to stand here and let you play me. Learn how to respect your elders. I'm sorry, man. If, if you don't want to stand, why don't you have a seat, old man? <laughs> man, what if? Hey, yo, at least you could buy some vintage things from me. Wait, wait, wait. Buy your auction. Yo, what up, y'all? I... Stop, real quick. If I order something from you, how long do I got to wait to get it? Easily 17 months. <laughs> hey, hey, real quick. Why your shipping costs way more than an actual item? Ah! Why are you killing me? Oh, I, I'm just playing with you. On a serious note, the Wish House is actually dope. Thank you. Hey, but how long did it take you to build that? What, 33 decades? <laughs> <laughs> I wish you didn't say that. 
Yeah, it's safe to say I'm the most entertaining sport out. You are bugging. No, you not. Shut up with that oversized jersey on. Wow, you came out the gate with that one. But come on, bro. Do you see the superstars we have? Yeah, I can only name three. We have way more talent on the field than y'all got on the court. It's funny that you mentioned court because due to COVID, we start back up on July 30th. But when do you start again? We kind of just like taking our time. We got plenty of time before preseason start anyway. Talking about some talent when y'all don't even have a start date. Wow. Y'all still collecting unemployment. Come on, low blow, bro. Everybody knows when you're talking about superstar and highlights, the NBA is where it's at. We're all over ESP. I guess. Did somebody say the most entertaining sport? Bro, nobody watches you. Have you ever even sold out an arena? Sure I have. Yeah, all y'all do is fight on ice, and I'm pretty sure those two things don't mix. What did you say? Nothing. Hey, what's up, guys? Here we go. The most boring sport to watch on TV. That's why you just get tickets. Yo, boring. Name five hockey teams. Oh, yeah. There's the, the Penguins. Uh, then there's the... Uh, the the, 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 I think it's, it's purple. It starts with a C. The, no, no. The, the, the Photons. The Photons. Take your time. I think it's one of them. Um... Yeah, what's up? No one's here to see you. Who just shows up unannounced? Tell them we're busy. Yeah, tell them to get lost. She's already inside. What? What? Hi. You just let random strangers into the house? She seemed non-threatening. Yeah, and we didn't hire an Elton John impersonator, but there's a lovely couple across the street, Rick and John. They probably did, so you're at the wrong house. No, I'm your new neighbor. My name's Chriselle. Not Christine, not Michelle, Chriselle. Huh, it's an interesting name. I know. It's my new name. My maid from a couple years ago's name was Chriselle and I just thought it was so unique and different. So I made her legally change her name and I took her name and legally changed it to Chriselle. And then I put in a request to the president of the Americas to make every other Chriselle change their name because I wanted to be the only one, but apparently you can't do that. So instead I put the sparkle emojis on both sides of my name legally. So instead of Chriselle, it's Chriselle. Well, it's lovely to have you in the neighborhood. Yeah, uh, would you like a beverage or something? Water. Sparkling. We have tap. The last time I had tap water was when I was physically dying of dehydration at Ibiza and they were all out of Boston Fiji water bottles. So this sweaty guy cracked out on Molly, put a beer bong of tap water into my throat. I would have rather died. Pass. We're gonna go to the park if you wanna join. Is there an after party at least? N no. Oh. Not to be rude, but these people are more lame than my prize pony I had to put down last week. I'm ready to order. Hey, what's up? Nick Robinson. Yeah, uh, can I get a Big Mac? Or what? What do you mean, or what? Can I have a Big Mac? What, what you gonna do if I don't give you the Big Mac? Do y'all not have Big Macs? Oh, we have them, we have them. We have them, but what you gonna do if I don't give it to you? What do you mean if you don't give it to me? Like, why wouldn't you? Oh, what you, what you? What you trying to do, Nate? What you? Why you? Why your hand move? What you? What you trying to get into? What you? I'm gonna just go. Oh, okay. Okay, guys, are you done eating? Yeah, can we get two checks? Um, bae, two checks? Um, my friend is here. Like, was you not gonna pay for me? Who said I'm paying for you? Well, you are a man, right? Well, since you're a woman, go make me a sandwich. Put some mayonnaise on it. Um... Excuse me? You can't tell me what I have to do just because of my gender. Interesting. Listen, if you're broke, just say that. <laughs> if you want to get punched in your jaw, just say that. Excuse me? Hey! Whoa, sir. What is the problem here? Is a problem? How you gonna solve it? Whoa, 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 whoa. Listen, calm down, babe, please. We was having a good day. Listen, boo, you better calm your man down. Why your wig just move? That horse trying to get into. Okay, sir, you gotta calm down. Hey, he, what is wrong? Tammy was one of the first. I'm telling you, Jason, these adults are insane. My mother killed my hamster. I'm so sorry for your loss. What was your hamster's name? Bartholomew Junkus Ginger snapped a third. Timmy and Jason separate right now.
No. What? You hold dominion with your marker and think you can tempt fate Shut to up. disband this recent fellowship. Fine, then you'll have detention after school. What the f Do you want to go to the principal's office? Like Leonidas at the hot gates, I shall quell your Persian horde. Timmy's cracked at Fortnite. You are in big trouble, mister. Your hatred is but a trinket to my treasure trove of lament. Timmy. Well, you may teach us the beginnings of Mesopotamia, but you teach nothing of achieving glory, you low-class sound. How about suspension? Bring me to the gallows for all to see. Timmy. Timmy, Timmy, etch the name Timmy into the sight of my execution, madam. For the blood of my sacrifice shall yield a bit of fruit which you shall choke on. Your disaster, a little clout. I am the clout. I'm so happy, Mark. Same, Rachel. Rachel and Mark. Hi, Timmy. What happened to mommy and daddy? We're still mommy and daddy. But then why did you say Rachel and Mark? Well, Timmy, mommy and daddy have names. What? Oh, God. So you're Mark and you're Rachel. Those are our names, but you can call us mom and dad. Oh, okay. Well, my name's Timmy, but you can call me Tyrannosaurus Marcus Aurelius Jr. No, your name is Timmy. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought we were doing. Just like making up names now, like pretend names. I'm sorry. I didn't understand the rules. I thought that's what we were doing. Well, that's what we do! Timmy, this is just how things are. Self-appointed suitors to deprave an innocent soul of his nuggies. You've got plenty of nuggies. Not nearly enough, sir. A pair of licentious, squabbling, normie gargoyles. Masquerading with such titles as some holier-than-thou zealot. Timmy, we're your parents, but we're also people. Then why use these distinctive titles? Because you're our child is a term of endearment. I am endeared to no one. Except Bartholomew Tungus, you just have a third R.I.P. forever and ever, sweet prince. Now you're just being disrespectful. I am disrespect! Dude, if Earth is the third planet from the sun, doesn't that mean that every country is a third world country? Be quiet! Light bulbs were such a good idea, they became the symbol for a good idea. You see what you did to Jared? He's having a mental breakdown because of you! Bro, lawyers hope you get sued. Doctors hope you get sick. Cops hope you're a criminal. Mechanics hope you have car trouble. But only a thief wishes you prosperity. Wishing you prosperity, Ryan. Is that my PlayStation? They say the asteroid killed all the dinosaurs. You could also say it killed many birds with one stone. <whistles> Reading a book is looking at a dead tree and hallucinating. Let me ask you something. Why? When you say forwards or back, your lips move in that direction. Oh yeah! Uno! Hey, why are you shouting? I'm right here. What? No, Dad, you call it out when you have one card left in your hand and one step away from beating you! We'll see about that, won't we, Mom? I don't know what you're talking about, son. I'm on no one's team. I love and support all my children equally. Oh, really? Well, then, can I play with you guys? Did you guys hear something? Nope. <sighs> Nothing. Didn't hear a thing. Dad, it's your turn. Uno! Dad, you can't say Uno. You still have two cards in your hand. Oh. Dos! Let's go, Mom. I'd like to see how you're gonna save your favorite child this time. I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about, Ryan. Go, Jimmy! With pleasure. Reverse! 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 Uno! Draw four. Change the color to red. He is inevitable. More things that we must cancel. LED lights because they do not have the black color and that is a racism. Arnold Schwarzo because his last name sounds like the racism word and that basically counts as him being racist. Being physically fit because that sets unhealthy beauty standards and makes lazy people feel bad about themselves. Mentos because calling them Mentos is assuming their gender which is big big sexism. Chess because the white pieces move first. Coincidence? Definitely. But it still offends me. Food, because I do not give my consent on being hungry. More things that must be cancelled. Breathing, because it is inconsiderate to people with asthma. Covid, because it is 19 and enters the bodies of minors, which is very, very pedophilic. Yin Yang, because it separates black and white, which encourages segregation. Water, because I do not give my consent on being thirsty. History, because it is saying that it's history, rather than herstory, themstory, or 2004 Honda Civic stories. Because it has the racist word in them, and therefore anyone who eats one is very racist. Eyes, because when someone has a black eye, it is considered bad, and that is a very big racism. Black eyes matter.